Hello. On the agenda now today is I've got a gym session this morning. Uh, I'm going to do my rehab at the gym, and then I've actually got a physio session uh, a little bit later on at the Royal Orthopaedic Hospital, just for a little bit of a sort of checkup from my last physio session um, to sort of monitor the progress, and also hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, I'll get all clear to jump back onto the bike, which I'm super excited about. If they give me clearance to do so. So, as I say, we'll see what they say about that today and we will move the needle from there. I went to the physio and they said I'm clear to pretty much do everything, which is amazing. I can go on the bike, I can swim, I can do everything that feels comfortable, apart from anything impact, like running. Um, but the only thing they said that I've got to really now focus in on is the loop band stuff, rehab stuff, strengthening it up three times a day because the control and strength to abduct, adduct, like lift it, move it, like isn't the best. You know, like this sort of range of movement is, that's my right leg and that's the better one. Whereas this one, still difficult to, pull it in any further than that, and that's where it was before, pre-op. So, a lot of it is atrophy uh, in the muscle tissue that I haven't used pre-op on the builder for three years, maybe, even longer. So it's like all the basic stuff you've got to build up. And brings me on to this exercise, which I fucking despise. <laughs> Tell you what, do not underestimate exercises like this. Like even if you're fit and strong, like this sort of stuff, surprisingly, it, it's open my eyes, put it that way. Right, band on. If you want to know anything about loop bands, you please give me a shout and let me know because at this point I know everything there is to know about a loop band. <laughs> Session number one on the Watt bike today, I'm just gonna prep as normal, take my stuff, take my kit, go onto the bike and see how it feels, see if I can get some movement through it, uh, take some gym kit as a backup just in case it does give me some aggro and I have to uh, pivot and adapt and do something else, and I'll see you in the gym. Just realized I'm gonna have a logistical nightmare with this. So, clipping my feet in on the Watt bike with these, <laughs> it's gonna be a test. <laughs> so, bought a set of pliers to get it on, because I can't quite bend my legs still. Um, which means that when my foot's on the bike clipped in, I'm gonna have to use the pliers to try and pull the bower clip up to release the shoe, because I won't be able to twist it out. <laughs> so this is gonna be interesting. Just literally tapped into zone two. 116 beats a minute at 120 watts, half an hour in. Everything feels okay at the minute. It doesn't feel uncomfortable, it just feels weird. Um, so as I say, I'm gonna try and get another 30 minutes in. Finish just an hour, steady, nothing stupid, but it's exciting because the needle's moved and we're on the bike, which is a really, really nice feeling. So 30 more minutes, hold it where we are, session done.